What is worship? This is a word that Christians often use to describe singing songs together or actually even an entire genre of music. But is that all it really means? Let's find out as we explore the meaning of this important word. When Christians use the word worship to refer to music and singing, they're actually right to do so. The Bible frequently makes this connection, encouraging God's people to worship him through songs, to sing psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs, to sing to the Lord because of who he is and what he has done. But this understanding just scratches the surface of what worship really is and what it means for us. The best way to understand worship is to think about what's most important to us. Whatever that is, is what we worship. It holds the highest place of priority in our hearts. It is what we value more than anything else. But who or what should that be? Who or what should we worship? Christians believe that God alone is worthy of worship and that all worship exists to give him the honor and praise that's his due because of who he is and what he has done for us by sending Jesus into the world to save sinners. In this sense, in the truest sense, Worship extends into all of life. Worship affects how we work, it affects how we conduct our relationships, how we handle money and practice generosity. You name it, worship is, is a component of that. Everything we do is an act of worship intended to encourage and strengthen other Christians while showing those who do not know God how incredible he is.